church. And I got the picture of the Pope. In the Pope mobile. You liar. Tell me the truth. Fine. The government was giving it away for free. <laughs> yeah, right. What, you don't believe me? No. Fine, then I'll tell you the truth. Fine. So I go to the supermarket today, and I see a crowd of women all gathered there and protesting because the government had decided to raise the prices. <gasps> the manager was saying, there's nothing I can do about it. It's free market, free competition. So I told him, we'll pay anything we want. And if we don't like it, we won't pay anything at all. So I started shouting, we won't pay, we won't pay. And then, and then he ran to the telephone, but the line was cut. So he starts pushing us, we push him, he pushes us, and then he pushes a woman and she pretends to fall on the floor as if he puts her in the oh. Antonia, sorry. And then, and then I look at him and I say, coward, how dare you punch your pregnant woman in the belly? Baby killer. And then, what happened? And then, the police came. So we walked out. We were calm, collected, and honest. We were like Hillary Clinton defending her man. And we looked at him and I said, Officers, arrest those thieves. It was great. How beautiful. It was absolutely thrilling. And not because we didn't pay for any of the things we got, no but because for once in our lives, we're standing up for what we believe. Soon, they're going to have to put those anti-theft devices on every single on you. But what about your husband? Um, he's not gonna write a story about the Pope Mobile or the government. My Luigi would kill me if I told him that. Mine would just lock himself up in the closet. In the closet? Yes, yes, every time we have a fight, he's very organized about it. He gets his little chair, his little flashlight, his little book, Dante's Inferno, and he locks himself up. And what about the stuff that we have? Oh, well, there's enough uh, here and here to feed the daycare center. Come, I insist you take some. Let's see. Oh, yeah. 
is a search. Here's one. We're searching the whole building. What for? Stolen merchandise. You come into my house looking for stolen merchandise? That's like calling me a thief, a liar, a cheater. I get my orders not to carry them out. But it's 
pot in here. Why, well, what if she's, uh, what if she's in labor? Already? I'd better go call an ambulance then. What? No, 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 Talk to him first. 
person? Yes. But what about the, the cow? I know. I'll start with the Pope. Yes, yes. The Pope. Great idea. Man, I feel like a woman. Da, 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 da. Ooh. Da, 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 da. Oh. Well, well, what is that? An olive. Olive? Pickle juice? I never knew. We spent nine months floating in our mother's bellies in olives and pickle juice? Huh. Giovanni! 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 Well, what are you doing here at this hour? Something happened actually later, but to ask my wife. We went home and the doors were open, but nobody was there. Uh, she left a few minutes ago with Antonia. Where did she go? And what for? It's a woman's thing. It's something that you wouldn't be interested in. We should only be interested in men's things. What do you mean I shouldn't be interested? I'm very interested. Ah, sure. Now you're interested, are you? And where were you one month ago when you were supposed to return to bed like everyone else? In bed? For what? Sure, it's the same old story. We, we give them paychecks and we say, pay the bills. We make love to them and we say, take the pills. And then when they're pregnant, it's, you take care of it. What does all that have to do with the fact that my, mm, mm, my great someone's off with the doors open? Without leaving a note, just a feeling what? Leave you a note? Why would she leave you a note? You're not supposed to be here. What are you doing here? Scored stoppage. We are protesting because they wanted to install parking meters in front of the factory. But we shouldn't pay anything. Are you crazy? We shouldn't pay anything? Who have you been talking to? The government? Or, or was it that police officer without the mustache that looked like the soldier with the mustache? I'll ask you one more time. Where's my wife called Pachu? Just give me a moment. Wait. Giovanni! Giovanni! Come on, I was kidding you. I'm not gonna punch you. Giovanni! Fine, suit yourself. I'm eating your food, and the olives are great. You're actually eating that olive? Yes. Should I die? No, no, you shouldn't have. That's your wife's olive, you boob. You even stooped eating fetus. What? My wife's olive? What are you saying? Giovanni, come on. Giovanni! Giovanni! Giovanni, I said, come on. Luigi, I'll tell you something. Oh, look, a giant burger. Oh. Oh, what are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? First, there's a slipping part. Then, there's a problem about the pill. That has no effect. And that's because, that's because the Pope, yes, he comes to your wife in her dreams going, Make a baby. Don't take the pill. Actually, Margarita doesn't take the pill. She has a malformation down there in the, what you want to call it? You're the one with the malformation. In your head! She's perfectly healthy. In fact, she's having a baby. When? This minute. Stop joking around. Tell me what's my wife will punch you. I don't remember. Uh, wait, wait. wait. Wasn't that gyno, the gyno ecologic place? Yes, yes. What's that? Where do you mean living? It's a place where they do the premature baby transplants. They take the baby from the belly of one woman who couldn't take it any longer and put it in the belly of another woman. <gasps> Antonia! She's right there. She's gonna be the first one they have. And she's what? crazy enough to do it. What are you doing? She's gonna have a transplant. Oh, come on! Antonia! Antonia! Giovanni! Giovanni! Gigi! He's not here. Come in. Oh, I'm getting so tired, Miss Antonia. Oh, you're such a complainer. I wish I just faith in people. Me? I have faith in people. No! Somebody stole my packet of rice! Where's my packet of rice? Oh, oh. <laughs> it's right here. Uh, give me some, uh, give me another packet of rice. I I I'll make you some soup. Stealing.
stealing all my ideas. Soon they're going to be pregnant men and pregnant dogs. <sighs> Antonia, I thought it over. I'm coming with you. I knew you'd make the right decision. Now come on, let's put some things in our lives. Leave this. Turn this off. <laughs> Giovanni has a, his father has a shed. He grows vegetables there. It will make a great hiding place. And that's perfect. But what do I tell Luigi? Because I don't have a baby or a belly. Oh, I already thought of that. You did? Yes, you had a hysterical pregnancy. <gasps> hysterical? Yes, yes, you see, you get all the symptoms. Uh -huh. But then when it comes time to deliver, all that comes out is air. Just air. And how would I have gotten this hysterical pregnancy? Oh, now we're talking about the story. Oh, well, look at all the times you've dragged us into stories. Come on, let's go. Come on. Today is the day of the moms. Oh.
Someone's coming.
Mason. <laughs> We're still in the room. Well, it's, it's not him. It looks like him, but it's not him. <laughs> you're right, it's not. I'm, I'm sorry for laughing, but you're the spitting image of the police officer without the mustache that looks like the soldier, you know, the other soldier. No, I'm an undertaker. <laughs> what? I bury dead people. Ah. <laughs> and you have that gun in the building. And since you live here, I leave the casket with you. <laughs> well, why don't you just leave it in the hallway? No, I can do that. Someone responsible has to get it. <laughs> Okay, fine. I'll take care of everything. But, but you must let us put our bags into it. They're awfully heavy, you see. It has a lid, I hope. Uh, uh, like, it's cheap, but you always make it with a lid. <laughs> you hear that? What a great country you live in. Every casket has a lid. Oh. Okay. I'll leave it with you. <laughs> Yeah, it could break. Yes, yes. 
And it could definitely break. Yeah. Giovanni, what's that? I can't believe you went and had to transplant without telling me first. What is that? All it would have taken is a phone call. One phone call. What hello, is that? hello, everything's okay. Don't worry, I'll be home soon. Giovanni, what is that wooden object in the back? It's a surfboard. Yes. What do you expect us to do when it fires in December? We'll go surf the Atlantic in January, of course. In fact, it's something totally different. It's a cradle, yes. When Luigi, when, when I told Luigi that he was going to be a father, the first thing he said was a cradle. A cradle. A cradle? A cradle? Yes. So then we went to the most modern cradle store that we could find and got the best cradle on the market. It's a Toyota from Japan. All you have to do is put the baby inside, and then when it cries, it will tap in. Whoosh! The spin of death! And it stays stiff for weeks. But is it, is, it, is it too big for a baby? Well, they keep on growing these days. This is unbelievable. Excuse me. I'm not disturbing you. Oh, Dad! Come in, come in! These are my friends. This is my father. Hi. My yes. Have you noticed that your father looks a little like the soldier with the monster that looks like the policeman with the monster? Yeah, but don't tell him that. He's getting a little senile. Yeah. I'm not senile. Oh, Antonio, how beautiful you look. You're getting so much younger all the time. <gasps> no, Dad. That's not Antonio. This is Antonio. Oh, it's that too. Yes, hi, Papa. It's me. Hey, what are you doing in there? Are you sick? No, she's expecting a baby. Oh, is that so? And where is he gone? Don't worry, he'll be back. Oh, he's back already, and he's all grown up. Don't make your mama wait at the time. No, 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 no that, 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 that's a friend. That's good. You should always be friends with your children. But I can here to tell you, they have thrown you out of your house. What? Yes, yes. This letter, look, came to my house by mistake. It says for one, I haven't been paid. But there must be a mistake. Antonio always pays the rest of the time. Isn't that right, Antonio? Yes, of course. See? Anyway, they're going to clear out the whole building because hardly anybody has been paid. Who told you that? The sheriff, who is clearing people out apartment by apartment. A nice man. Oh, come take a look at the street. It's full of police cars. <gasps> oh, look at that formation. It's oh like my God, it's there. really happening. It's happening. Antonia, how did this happen? Don't shout, you'll scare the baby. Okay, I'll speak softly. Tell me, how did it happen? Fine. You see, I didn't pay the bill. I didn't. No, no, not the rent. I didn't. What? I didn't pay any of it. Luigi. What? I have to tell you something. Huh? I haven't paid the rent. No. See, it's not just us. It's people across the street, people in this building. It's everybody. But then why didn't you just tell me? Why? So that you can have a fit and Tell me at least that you have paid the gas. Yes, yes, I paid it. Oh, that's great. I can't believe this is happening. No, Antonia, don't cry. It's not good for the baby. Yes, yes, everything will be all right. Oh, I just remembered. I found this in my shed this morning. It must be yours. <gasps> what is this? Tomatoes? Another tomato? Smarties? No, Dad, this isn't our stuff. Sure it is. I saw Antonia go up. Uh, uh, Antonia come out of my shed this morning. What? Oh, yes, yes. You see, uh, I bought these from the supermarket at reduced price. I only paid half. The rest I stole. Stole? You do? You can come see me. I'm going to get you. 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 I'm going what? No, that's totally different. We were in the middle of the street. Well, she, she's a direct thief, a dirty criminal. Fine, oh, yes. Yes, I'm a thief. Yes, I am. And you know what, Giovanni? I also toy with your emotions of father. What? Because, uh, you know, what I have under here is not a baby. It's rice and pasta. No. The baby. No. The chestnut. No. no. Now that I've done what I came to do, 
We're going to be homeless. Let's take all the food we can. 